and what's up everybody it's your boy Richard back with another reaction video and today as you see we're gonna be reacting to what S M L S M L like one of the greatest channels on YouTube and today as you can see we're going to be reacting to SMO because they released a new video and it's Valentine's Day related. Yes, it's officially Valentine's It's officially Valentine's Day. So, hopefully you guys are having a nice Valentine's Day. And yeah. And you guys have a girlfriend. I'm I actually wonder, do you guys actually have a girlfriend or a boyfriend or a girlfriend, whatever whatever gender whatever gender you are. Do you have a girlfriend or a boyfriend? Whatever gender you are. Because I want to know. Tell your boy Richard. Like, tell your boy Richard. Because Richard wants to know. So, I was a little bit late on this video. I was a little bit late on this video. Because I was finishing making my OBM movie. The new OBM movie video that probably came out already. Already. And it's called Teal's Valentine. Valentine, I think. Yeah, Teal's Valentine. So, we're going to be reacting to SML. And this one is called Junior's Valentine's Day Gift. So, let's start this up. You guys know the line. Back. Junior, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Yeah. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Wait, is today Valentine's Day? Hold on. Yeah, today is Valentine's Day. It's Wednesday. Junior, are you excited? It's our first Valentine's Day together. My girl, girl, does he look like he care, bro? He, he, he more. He's he cares more about playing his uh Fortnite, whatever he's playing on. Yeah, it's fun. Junior, come on, pay attention to me. Hold on. Nah, bro. He he paying attention to the game. He don't pay attention to you. Cause honestly, we don't pay attention to these hoes. I mean, it's facts, but yeah, we don't pay attention to these hoes. I'm playing Black Ops 3 Zombies with my friends. But Junior, Black Ops Zombies? Look, what type of Fortnite? Zombie what type of game is that? Me, okay? I Never heard of that game before. What? I already forgot what it's called, bro. I never heard of that game. Steve Cole and Double Tap Root Beer and Juggernaut. I can't go down right now. What? Look, Cody has the water waffle. Hold on. Oh, you bitch! Oh, you bitch! Turn it back on! Junior, come on! Let's talk about Valentine's Day! What about it? You're supposed to get me something! I got you the- Bruh. Girl. Does he look like he care about you? No! Girl. You look at Junior. What is he doing? Playing video games. That's what he cares about. He doesn't care about you. And I, I can see that. I can see why. Cause you ugly as hell. The best gift ever. It's the greatest gift ever. You've always asked for. It. Really? Yeah, it's in my closet. Oh my god, Junior, you do love me. I'm gonna go home right now. No, he doesn't. Go straight to bed so I can wake up and it's Valentine's Day already. <laughs> Stupid bitch. Oh, we lost. Oh, I went down. Oh, I bet they tried to revive me and they all died. Oh, Cody had the Wonder Waffle. I'm never gonna hear the end of this. What the fuck was that, Junior? Yeah, dude, it's like you weren't even trying. Why did you keep going down? Yeah, I had Quick Revive, and I kept trying to revive you over and over again, but you just kept going down. I he what? He kept being AFK? Well, um, it's, it's because of Penelope. It's all because of that B-word's fault. I need to use my monkeys, Junior, my monkeys. Are you blind? Why did you keep dying, dude? Yeah, and after you went down, you was we, AFK. Court, but we couldn't even use them because you just kept going down. And I had the Wonder Waffle with Pack-A-Punch. Why didn't you use your Gobble Gum? Well, I had the Gobble Gum that makes you invisible to zombies for 10 seconds, but I wasn't able to use it because Penelope turned off the TV. Oh, I know we didn't lose because of your stupid girlfriend, dude. I'm over this. Yeah, you should break up with her, bro. She annoying, bro. See, this is what I'm talking about. You should break up with her because she annoying, first off. <coughs> first off, she annoying. Second off, second off, uh, she don't look good. And third of all, she doesn't even have good glasses. She has glasses that don't even have glass in them. That doesn't even make them glasses. Why was she mad? Because tomorrow's Valentine's Day. It would be called Nuthless. What did you get her? 
Well, nothing. I, but I don't know what to get her. But I lied to her and told her I got her the greatest gift ever. Maybe you should kick her in the teeth. That's the perfect gift, dude. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, that's the perfect gift. Yeah. You know, my my boy, my boy Joseph is actually my homie. I don't know what to get, girls. I like women. My boy, that's why Joseph is my homie. Yeah. Joseph. Yeah, and Cody's definitely not going to be able to help because Cody be loving that dick and wiener and all that. I get her? Dude, I don't have a girlfriend. Maybe she just kick her in the teeth. Come yeah, on, guys. that's a good gift. Yeah. Joseph, let's go play duos and black ops. Yeah. Wait, 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 you're not going to invite me? No. What? No, you're, on, a, you're, oh. nah, you're a noob, bro. Noobs have girlfriends, bro. Pros don't have girlfriends. Who, who is someone that would know what Penelope Junior likes? is a noob. <gasps> her dad. And her dad's a police officer. I'm calling 911. Okay, I'm calling 911. 911, what's your emergency? Ah, someone just broke into my house and stabbed my dad five times. He's going for my mom. Come quick. Hey, somebody called the cops. Where's the killer? Oh, I lied about that. Oh, you little rascal. You. Oh, my God, bro. I'm surprised he didn't go to jail for that, bro. Really got me. I thought there was a killer here. You know, I sped here as fast as I could, ran straight over my neighbor's cat. I mean, I really creamed that little. God fucker. damn! Yeah, he's probably gonna bring that up at the next day show. Man, that bro. As soon as he heard the screaming, as soon as he heard Junior's mom getting stabbed or father getting stabbed five times, that bro was like, that bro was like this. Into the car he went, and then he just put the car into maximum maximum overdrive. <laughs> Way meeting. Oh, <laughs> what God the damn hell? it. They're going to put speed bumps in my neighborhood, aren't they? Probably right in front of my house, too. So thank you. Thank you for that. What, what do you want? Well, I'm dating your daughter. Oh, yeah, yeah, you are. Hey, 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 quick word of advice. If she's anything like her mother, she's going to grow up to be really fat and yeah. a huge bitch. And she's going to cheat on you in a Walmart parking lot with a whole bunch of guys. But you didn't hear that from me. Well, tomorrow's Valentine's Day, and I just don't know what to get her. I don't know. Get her chocolates or a candy cane or whatever the hell girls like. I don't know. Well, what are you going to uh, do? Well, girls like wieners, so I can give her my wiener for Valentine's Day. That's a gift. That's a good gift for her. Well, I'd kick her in the teeth if I had legs, but I guess I'll just <laughs> take it all. Regardless. Bro, that's exactly what Joseph said. Kick her in the teeth. That's Lee exactly what Joseph said. Those unlimited breadsticks. But hey, it's a fair trade because she eats some breadsticks and then she eats my breadstick, if you know what I mean. It's yeah, I know you did. She does that other than my birthday. And let me tell you, it is subpar. Well, I just thought since maybe she's your daughter, you would know what to get her for Valentine's Day. Listen, you're asking the wrong guy. I hate Valentine's Day. Why do you hate Valentine's Day? Oh, boy, do I have a fun little animation for you. Ah, uh, here we go again. Another Brooklyn guy animation story. So I was a senior in so, high school. So, get ready, guys. Get your popcorn, get your Coca-Cola, whatever you have. Get your popcorn, get your snack. And we're about to enjoy Brooklyn Guy's little little animation story. So let's just get into it. Well, I was a bit of a ladies' man. I had made out with at least three of the girls from the chess club. Not God, Lee, bro, what the frick? Oh, my God. First off, I don't know what, what type of girl that is. She got small boobs. This girl fat. And this guy... He doesn't even look like a woman. He doesn't even look like a bee. Not a lot of people were going after those girls, so I volunteered. B but word. Then, one day, I decided to go after a bigger prize. Katie knockers with the big hand. God. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Look at them cans, bro. Those things are so big. I can literally. I can literally. I can literally. I can use. Bro, them tits are so big, I can literally use those as punching bags whenever I'm boxing, whenever I'm, like, you know, punching a punching bag. I can use her tits as punching bags because that's how big her tits are. Ham hockers. She was the Bi hottest, bustiest girl in school. God you know, damn. Because of her big knockers, a.k.a. ham hockers. It was Valentine's Man. Day, and they had this candy gram that you could send to a girl you liked where some of the kids from the Glee Club would sing to them and hand them a note saying you liked them and shit. So I paid the $15, and I said, send this to Katie Knockers with the big ham hawkers. But one of the kids in the Glee Club, Dyslexic Dylan, wrote the wrong name down, and the candy gram was given to Deborah Dimpleass, one of the fattest, ugly- Oh my god, whoa. Oh my god. Man. Man. I, 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 can't, I can't even say that this is even a girl. A B word. The stinkiest- this, this is like the most- 
Bro, that's totally a man in, in in just pretending to be a girl. This is totally a man being a girl. Just pretending to be a girl. Resting bitch face girls in school. They gave her the candy gram and said, this is from Brooklyn guy. And man, was I so embarrassed. But Deborah loved it, I think. She wouldn't leave me alone. She came oh my to my God. house. I tried hiding from her, but my mom answered the door and she thought she was pregnant. And I told her, no, mom, she's just fat. But my mom made me marry her anyway. I always wondered what would have happened. Oh my God. God, what the hell, bro? And if I had given the candy gram to Katie Knockers, I heard she's a supermodel now. So that's oh why I hate Valentine's Day. I was just one dislike. Yeah, I can see why she's a supermodel with them tits. Yeah, hell yeah, she's a supermodel. As a kid away from being with Katie Knockers with the big ham hawkers, but instead I get my big, fat, ugly bitch of an ex-wife. So what made you marry her? My mom made me marry her because she thought she was pregnant. I had to take care of her food baby. But yeah, later I did get her pregnant, but that's another animation for another website. So you don't have no. any idea of what Penelope might like? Like, the whole time you've raised her, she's never said something that she likes? Well, when she was a little kid, she really liked Minnie Mouse. I mean, we could never actually afford to go to Disney World, but we would always drive down. Yeah, Disney World, Disney World is so expensive, bro. Like... When I went to Orlando, I actually went to Disney World, and boy, oh boy, that was expensive as hell. Disney World, oh my god, my mom had to borrow like $600 from me. Down there and look at Disney World. And also, guys, if you guys are saying, if you guys are wondering, bro, Richard, where on earth did you get $600 from? Um, it's called, uh, work through the fence and she would say daddy can we go inside and i'd say no honey we can't afford it let's go but minnie mouse did wave at her one time she was very excited until security came and told us we had to leave the property oh well, i can't afford to take her to disney world i mean shit neither can i well yeah so that shit expensive <gasps> what if we brought minnie mouse here how are we gonna do that yeah well, you're a cop why don't you go to disney world and say hey minnie mouse i need to interrogate you about a crime and you bring minnie mouse here on valentine's day <laughs> bro up, up, what the hell she'll get really excited and she'll love me yeah, I mean, you're right. I think she would lose her shit if she could meet Minnie Mouse. That would be the greatest gift of all time. Please do that for me. Please do that for me. Please. Okay, okay, I'll do it. But it's going to take me a day because i got to drive all the way down there. But you owe me, kid. I'm doing you a big favor here. Oh, Penelope's going to love this Valentine's Day. It's the greatest gift ever. <sighs> Where is he with Minnie Mouse? Oh, he hey, said he would take a day to a get to Disney right World. Man, my balls are sore. Oh, is this your son? Uh, no, I only have a daughter. Oh, do you think your daughter will accept me as her new mommy? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I um, guess. I don't know about that, girl. She's gonna love you. What was that about? Listen, man, I pull up to Disney, right? And I say, hey, Minnie, come here, hop in my car. She hops in, no questions asked. And then on the whole six hour drive really? here, gob, she's eating my cheese. What? What? No, what? Man, it's not the first time I banged her. What the hell? Like, it's hideous. Wait, wait hold on. Ain't no way, hold on. Yeah, but yeah, he's not gonna find out. But listen, I need you to get Penelope here. What the frick, bro? What? <laughs> right now, before Mickey realizes that Minnie's missing. Oh, okay, I'll do that. Who's that? I'm pretty what? sure that's Mickey. Wait, you turned your location off, right? No! Oh, oh my god, bro. Just tell him about us. He'll understand. N no, no. He, he won't understand our love. But oh my god, bro. I don't even, I don't, I don't even want to see Mickey Mouse, bro. I bet that bro is pissed. Alice, oh my that, god. Absurd. Oh, you're right. We can just tell him later. Yeah, later. We'll tell him later. For right now, we'll just say you're doing a meet and greet and we're paying you, okay? So just, just sit right there. Okay. Okay, get, get Penelope here right now. I'm gonna go distract Mickey. Uh, hello? Oh, hiya, pal. It's oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, not only Mickey Mouse came over, Donald Piss Dug came over here. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Mickey brought a friend over. Oh, my God, bro. Jesus Christ. Yeah, they pissed. Oh, my God. Minnie Mouse here. Oh no, there's no Minnie here. Donald, go wait in the car. I'll call you and Goofy if I need you. Ah! Listen, man, I tracked Minnie's location here. Why is she here on Valentine's Day? Listen, man, I think there's been a big misunderstanding. You see, my daughter's a big yeah, he Mouse pissed. fan, so I yeah, Mickey Mouse pissed. Same here. with Donald oh, Duck. Well, well, Minnie doesn't do. And and I bet Goofy's pissed too, and like the whole crew, even uh. What's what's her name? Uh, the Donald Girl Duck. Like, what's what is her name? Uh, Daisy. Yeah, I bet Daisy's pissed too. And uh, even uh, I think even like um, uh, uh, Pluto. Pluto. I, I bet Pluto's even pissed. I don't know if that's his name, but it's the dog. The table without me. 
Oh, she was doing some business under the table. Oh, well, how about I go to your house and sleep with your wife? I mean, hey, have at it, man. Oh, Goofy, go bang this man's wife. With pleasure, Mickey. To what Goofy's the on his way to bang your wife. Look, let's oh just come God, inside. Bro, oh, my what? He will. He doesn't pull up. No, no, I mean, come inside and I'll take you to Minnie. Yeah. See, there she is. Minnie, what are you doing here? Oh, Mickey, I'm here to meet this man's daughter for a meet and greet. No, you're not, Minnie. I told you you're not doing business without me. We're going back to Disney World right now. Wait, wait, wait. Can't you just meet my daughter first? Yeah, please. Yeah. No. Oh, come on, Mickey. They're paying me. How much? Uh, a thousand dollars. Where's the money? Um. Um, it's in his bank account. I, 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 I cash apped it. Let me see your cash app. Uh, I, I logged out because it was being weird. So now, oh, oh, hey, my phone's ringing. Maybe it's cash app. Hello? Oi, you'll never guess who was at the front door. Goofy. Oh. It's Goofy. Go uh -huh. Oh, yeah, Goofy is about to clap them cheeks. Oh, my God. Hey, Karen, don't answer the door. Oh, I already... He already answered it. Hey, okay, but don't let him in. Oh, this is... He's already in. House. Can I see the bedroom? Yeah, it's down the hall. Oh, Karen, don't show him the bedroom. Oh, what a bouncy bed. You want to bounce on it with me? Sure. Hold on, boy. I'm going to put the phone down. Oh, Karen, he, Karen, he's don't. totally going to clap off. them it's cheeks. It's bounce that way. No, Karen, don't do that. Go hook. Go hook. Oh yeah, he clapping them Goofy's cheeks. At my house banging my wife. I oh yeah, he clapping them play. cheeks. She's part of a good troop now. Kid, where the hell is Penelope? I don't know. Okay, I'll go, I'll go, I'll go answer the door. Hello. Happy Valentine's Day, Junior. I got you a Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty? What the fuck, bitch? What the hell? Man, girl, I don't like Hello Kitty, bro. I don't, what, what is even Hello Kitty? I don't even know what that even is. What the hell? What what is Hello Kitty? I, I guys, I swear to God, I'm being dead serious right now. What the hell is Hello Kitty? I never heard of it. What? Anyways, girl, that's a dumb gift. Oh, exactly what I like, Hello Kitty. You like cats, Junior? Yeah, I, I guess. Yeah, I I, I like cats, but I don't like cats for like girls. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I'm fucked up by. I'm pretty sure I'm fucked up right now, right now. Well, I got your meet and greet with a really famous girl. <gasps> oh my god, who? Billy Eilish? No, no, Minnie Mouse. Oh. Someone you've always wanted to meet and greet with. Okay. Come on up. Minnie I got Mouse. you a meet and greet with Minnie Mouse. Oh, Minnie Mouse? Yeah, remember Penelope? You said you love Minnie Mouse. Yeah, when I was like five. But remember that one time she waved at you through the gate for free? You waved at the We oh. don't need to tell him anything. Oh, yeah, Minnie? Well, what is it? Well, me and this man, we're in love. You're what, Dad? Yeah, she, she doesn't know what she's talking nah, about. Nah, nah, bro. They were doing some inappropriate things in the, in Brooklyn guy's car. Yeah, he was clapping them yeah. mouse cheeks. Dad? He was clapping them mouse right cheeks. Now, so I think we're even. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm gonna go roll your wife now, too! Oh my god, Mickey Mouse is gonna tag team. Oh god, Brooklyn guy's oh, wife. On speaker. Hello? Oh my god, bro. Bro, Donald Duck is even there, bro. Who's gonna be next? Who's gonna be next? Freaking Pluto the dog? I don't know if that's his name, but whatever his name is, is he gonna be next to clap them cheeks? Because... Donald Ducks, uh, Donald Ducks is already clapping them in the cheeks, and now Mickey Mouse is gonna get some action. I'm about to get her my steamboat, will it? Will it, Mickey? Oh, hot dog! Oh, oh. What the oh he pissed. Brooklyn guy getting pissed. Oh, he pissed. Look at his face. Look at his face. Oh, uh, look at Brooklyn guy's face, bro. Look at Brooklyn guy's face. He's like so pissed Why right now. Because Tom is small. I know what. I think I'm just gonna hang up. Yeah. Dad. I'll see you at home, Penelope. Wait, baby, wait for me. The hell? I'm so sorry I caused all this. I just didn't know what to get you for Valentine's Day. Thanks for the Hello Kitty. I'll, I'll leave you alone. <laughs> okay. That. I mean, that was. That was definitely not. That was definitely not part of the plan, but uh, it is what it is. But anyways, that was SML movie Junior's Valentine's Day gift. It was the most 
inappropriate and bizarre gift ever. Who was your Valentine? Come on, be real, guys. You, you guys know my Valentine, bro. You guys know my Valentine, right? Come on. Come on. Is this house. My Valentine is this house that I'm living in. I know it sounds stupid, but, like, man, I, I just love being home. It, it, home is just... You guys can never, ever go wrong. You can never, ever go wrong with sitting in your house for, like, three days. You can never say... You can never say, no, I don't want to stay in the house for three days. You can never say that. You can, now, you can never say that. Like, I enjoy living in this house. Actually, like I actually like being here when it's uh, snowy and rainy. It's cozy. That's what home is for. But anyways, you guys know what to do. And I am out. Come on, uh, Bunzo Bunny. Come on. You might as well do the outro for me. Peace.